Hello, hello, Rafael and Fernando. Hello, mister. I don't know if you can hear me. Yes, I can. Oh, Do yeah. you have... Yes. Yeah, I can, I can hear you, Fernando. Fernando, okay. do you have zero in the first form? Yeah, yeah, and I don't know why, but I did that before. Okay. No worries. Thank you for letting me know. Let me write down your name right here in a piece of paper, and I will check that right after the class. Just and I tried, I tried to check uh, the forum uh, on Scology, but oh, yeah, I, no, it's not there. I, I, I took count. it off. <laughs> oh, okay. I, I, I took I, it off. I mean, it's there, but it's just that you cannot see it. <laughs> but it's there. So it's, trust it's not for the whole, you know. <laughs> exactly. I unpublish um, it. So let, yeah. let me put your name right here. Fernando. For yeah, you, number one. Check. All right. Thank you, Fernando. Okay. Thank you. I will okay. I will check on that break. All okay. right. Let's see. Freddie, Alejandra, and Rafael. Very good. Good evening. Good evening, good evening. All right. Let's see. Um Jose, thank you for thank you for joining, sir. Thank you. Uh, mm, 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 mm. Okay. Oh, I am receiving the homeworks right now. Okay, that's good. That's good. So that means that you are working on it. So I'm gonna go ahead and check the homework later and I will make the corrections, the necessary corrections, like um, after the class or maybe by Sunday, everything's gonna be updated. All right. So, the, oh, yes? A question, um, can I send you the homework after the class? Definitely, please okay. do it, all right? Okay. And okay. Sylvia, you were asking yeah. what was the, what was the uh, homework number two? The, the number two, yeah. Yes, the homework number two is so it was not a homework. It was an activity that we did that we did here. It was the one for the for the audio. Oh, okay. Because I haven't a score in the in That's, the table. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and, and update it. All right. So don't worry. Because oh, you sent okay. you okay. sent me the audio, right? Yes, I sent the, the audio and I send you the picture uh, just a moment. All Here right. We'll... Let's see. Sylvia, can you send me a text with hi? Just just type hi so I can find your chat here. All right. And I can uh look for that. But don't worry. I'm gonna I'm gonna make okay. the corrections, okay? Don't worry. Okay. All right, thank you. Guys, please check the, the grades. If there is any mistake with the grades, please let me know so I can correct the grades, the scores. All right. Uh, okay, Christina, I understand. Thank you for letting me know. All right, more people connecting here. Let's say we have uh, Diana, uh, Alejandra, Carlos, Raul, Rebecca, Joseph, Veronica, Christina, Sylvia. Uh, Jonathan, Good evening. Right. Joseph, thank you. Okay, guys, so just make sure to send the homework because if not, you're going to have a zero in that part of the evaluation. All right, so you're going to have until today, midnight, in order to send it. All right, and I'm, I'm still, I have some of them right here. Good, good. All right, so let's begin then with uh, the class four. For today, what about uh, tomorrow and Sunday? Are you going to the beach with this heat? Are you going to the discotheque to hang out with your friends? No, what are you doing tomorrow? Jonathan, what are you doing tomorrow? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Hey, everyone. Um, tomorrow I have a meeting with my super supervisor 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 and mm -hmm. at 7 a.m and later uh, uh, i connect connect at my work at age 
H A M M M finish my work at 2 p.m. and I return to my house and I I, I rest okay all the time and okay. Sunday all right that's good that's good to rest a little bit to Very rest good. thank you thank you Jonathan what about the rest any plans for tomorrow or, or no, just you like staying home. Good evening. Uh, for tomorrow, I have a day off. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Yay! So, what are you gonna do in your day off? Uh, only sleep. Only sleep? Yeah. And, and play on my computer. All right. <laughs> All right. It's valid. To today talk. for me it will be a, a very busy day. Oh yeah. Okay. So yeah, it's good. Take uh take some naps, uh rest and recharge batteries and energy. All right, that's good. Excellent. All right, people, let's go with the first activity for today. It's Friday. Let's make a great uh end of the week. So let's start with the class. I will send a word category in the chat in Zoom here in Zoom, right? I will type a word category and you have to write only one, not two, only one word uh, for that category, all right? For example, if I say fruits, you type the names of fruits that you know, all right? So this is for everyone, all right? So I, I type the category of the of the you know that I'm thinking of and you start typing vocabulary with that category is that clear is this clear yeah it's clear excellent yes, all right so let's go category this is for everyone everyone can participate all right so please try to um show off our vocabulary so uh, the first category will be, just a second, ready, let's go, European countries, European, in Europe, all right, good, good, let's go, only three, okay, four, good, roll Let's go, Spain, no more Spain, let's go. Italy, all right, no more Italy. Okay. Russia. Okay, let's go. Barcelona is a country. Mm. Ukraine, all right, let's go. Korea, Moises, Korea is not from Europe. Korea is not from Europe, <laughs> but it's good. I love Korea. All right, so let's, Belgium, one more. Come on, there are like, like 60, 60 countries, 50 countries. All right, Germany is good. All right, excellent. All right, good, 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 good. All right, let's see. Let's review them right now. So we have um, uh, Italy, Netherlands, Netherlands, all right. Netherlands, or what was the previous name for Netherlands in English? Holland. I'm sorry? Holland. Holland. Thank you, Jose. Thank you. Very good. So that was like the previous uh, name for it, but then they changed it to Netherlands. All right. Russia. All right. Ukraine, Korea, Poland, Italian, Belgium, Portugal. Germany. All right. Very good. Let's continue with the next category. This is good. Let's go with this. All right. Let's go with this one. Go. No more hands. 
no more head, no more foot, all right? Feet, foot, all right? All right, one more. One more, nose, all right? One more. No more heads, all right? Just that once? What about the rest of the body? From like uh, the shoulders down. What, it, what, what do we have from the shoulders down? Okay, knees. Thank you, Jose. Now we're getting there. Lumps. All right. What else? What else? Stomach. Bones. Right. Chest. All right. Keep. Good, Rebecca. Good. Spine. All right. Legs. Chin. Neck. Good job. All right. Eyelashes, all right. You care about the eyelashes, right, Diana? <laughs> all right. Like a like a like um like a very responsible woman, you care about the eyelashes. That's good. Eyelashes. How do you say how do you say cejas? Everyone? Uh-huh. Everyone, how do you say cejas? Eyelashes. I Eyebrows. Good, Diane. Awesome. Awesome. All right. How do you say nuka? It's neck. not neck. Nope. <laughs> yeah. Nope. No. Neck is this. Neck is this. Nuka is aquí. How do you say me dieron en la nuka? <laughs> Back neck? Uh, no. <laughs> it's not back neck. You can Google it. Let's see. Nuka, but in English. <laughs> how, do, how do you say nuka in English? It's very, it starts with the letter N. It starts with the letter N. Back neck. Uh -huh. Back neck. <laughs> no. Nape. Nape. Thank you, Fernando. Nape. That's the nuka. Okay. Excellent. Very good. Nape. All right. How do you say dedos del pie? Don't tell me fingers because they are not fingers. Feet. No, that's feet. Toes. Toes. Excellent. So in the feet, we have toes. We don't oh, have. Oh, yes. Toes. Yes. <laughs> All right. Excellent. How do you say Dedo gordo. This one. How do you say this one? Fat finger. Uh, yes, it's a yes. Well, the fat finger. <laughs> but there's another name for this one. It's very common. How do thumb. you call it? A thumb. Thank you, Moises. Very good job. How do you call this one? El meñique. The ladies use their finger. I'm sorry. <laughs> Kinky. The finger. Pinky. Pinky promise. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Little, this is a pinky. Little finger. The, the, the little finger. <laughs> a chiquitito, a little chiquitito. All right. <laughs> All right. Good. Good. All right. How do you call no, this one? No, it's pinky. This one. Pinky. Uh, okay. Uh, anular. Mm -mm. But in English, con el que apuntamos. Uh, index. All right. Uh, you're on fire. Uh, Excellent. Very good. Very good. Okay, guys. Excellent. So that was for the parts of the body. Let's go with a different one. Let's go with this one. Let's see. Um... Okay, hmm, this is good. Let's see what you have to, to say about this one. Mammals. Mammals. Dolphin? Type it, oh. all right. Yeah, dolphin, good. Okay, okay. Dolphin, dogs, excellent. Dolphin, it's cats. What else? It's a mammals. 
All right. Ballena, ballena. Bears. All right. Lions. Mm. Tigers. Mm. Mm. Elephants. Boy. All right. Moose. Whale. What is what is moose? Uh huh. What is moose? What is moose in Spanish? What do we call moose? Answer. Hmm? What was that? Answer. Excellent. Is an oh. answer. How do you say venado? Deer. Like like deer. Oh my dear. But is this the spelling is different? It's D E E. -R. What is cougar, Moose? Oh, cougar? cougar. It's a cougar. What's a cougar? cougar. It's a puma. It's a uh huh. Mm. Do we? Yeah. Yeah, is a cougar. Horse, cow, monkey, buffalo, wolf. All right. Good, good, good. Excellent. A camel. All right. Let's go with the next category. Let's see how much you know about this category. And uh, this is going to be, oops. Let's going to be for this one. Jobs with a good spelling, good spelling. Carpenter, nurse, good. Let's go. Let's continue. That are entering. All right, there we go. Mechanic, waitress. What else? Nurse. Delivery messenger. A S. Good. Teacher, engineers, saleswoman. What else? Lawyer. Mm hmm. Chef. Mm -hmm. What else? Dentist. Okay. Radiologist. Radiologist. All right. Very good. Now, who can tell me what is the difference between police? Good. Firefighter. Excellent. Now, what's the difference between a lawyer and an attorney? Because, for example, in the States, in the United States, the term lawyer is not that common. They use a lot of attorney. So what's the difference between lawyer and attorney? It's like in Spanish, you know, uh, abogado and notaria. Excellent. That's good. So attorney is como un notario, right? And a lawyer is just like a, a, a lawyer. Right, but if you want to go to court, you need an attorney. All right, excellent, very good, guys. So let's see, let's continue then with the next part of this one, and uh, and let's go with um cut corners. Let's see, let's see. Uh, Raul, help us read cut corners. Cut corners. We could finish this project early and if we cut corners. Uh-huh. So what does it mean, Ro? Look at the picture. You can read it one more time. What is cut corners? It's like is take the straight path. Straight cut. Mm. Like, what do you mean by straight cut? What could be a straight, uh, like a cut corner? I, I mean, this is uh huh. Do, do something with a shortcut. Oh, it's related to that. All right, it's related to that. So, anybody else? Thank you, Fernando. So what is cut corners? So if I say, for example, hey, Sylvia, hey, Veronica, hey, Freddie, hey, Marco, hey, Jose, we have this project for Monday. We are not going to finish it if we don't cut corners. So what does it mean? Does it mean Be that we need to do it? Uh-huh. Be efficient. Be efficient, yes. And how are you going to be efficient? By finding the, the easiest 
way to do something. So cut corners is, encontremos la forma más fácil de hacerlo. Right? That's cut corners. So we need to end this project right now. We need to cut corners. All right. So we need to do it easily. All right. So that's the meaning of cutting corners. Excellent, Ro. Thank you. Thank you, Rafa. Thank you, the ones who spoke and participated. All right. So superlatives. Before we continue, I was checking the homeworks. The homeworks were great. There were just a little mistakes, but the most important part of the superlative, guys, is please do not forget the word B is mandatory. The strangest, the most efficient, the biggest, the most intelligent. All right. Don't forget the article, the. All right. So most of you did a great job. Maybe just one or two little details, but that's it. All right. So let me um, continue with this. We're going to do uh, one exercise right now together. And then you are going to do one exercise individually and one exercise in group. All right, so let's begin with the one that we are going to do here in general with everybody right here. All right, so let's see. This is the exercise right now. Jose, what is the instruction for this exercise, please? Choose the correct answer. Choose the correct answer. Okay, so I'll have a drop down menu and we need to select the correct answer. You can participate only once so we can uh, make sure everyone says something. Let's go. Number one, anyone can participate. This is volunteer, voluntarily. All right, let's go. Harder and harder. Number two? Number two for me. Two. All right. Can I say more harder? No. All right. Because the sub, I mean, the adjective is short. All right. So let's continue with the number two. The most. The most. The most. The most. The most. The most. Most. All right, all right. Number three. Lesser. Oh. Lesser. Oh. Lesser. Okay, Lesser. let me explain this one. Thank you for that, because I didn't explain this one. So we have lesser, what is lesser? Lesser is the opposite of the most, okay? So the most is the opposite of the lesser. The most, el más, and the lesser, el menos. The menos, the less. Okay. Excellent, excellent, okay. And we duplicate the letter S because uh, uh, there is a, a, a vowel, cons uh, uh, consonant, vowel, and consonant. Exactly, good. All right, so we can In continue. In this case, with... it's not necessarily the article D. Excellent, thank you. No, with lesser, we don't need it. Thank you for that. Good observation. All right. Let's continue with the number four. What about this one? Read carefully. Far in a way. A bit the better. A bit the better. Far and away, she was far and away the, be the better, the better singer. Yes, yes, this is the correct one. 
when do I when do I use a bit? Hmm. Okay, we can use a bit in this type of situation. For example, the the coke, right? The coke was a bit tepid. Yes, tepid. Tibial. All right. So I exactly. So the coke was a bit tepid. It was not cold. Un poco, a bit, all right? So in this case, yeah, we can use a bit, all right? So number five, you guys. The worst. The worst. The worst. The worst. The worst. The worst. Okay. Okay. Tom and Margo. This is the second. The second. Easy as no se dejen ir, lean ah, la oración. Ah, ah, easy. 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 Awesome. Let's go. Let's read the complete sentence. All right. Number seven. What about it? It's um. Only. Quite. My exam results are Quite. only. What is marginal? Marginally. Hasta cierto margen. Ah. E quite. But yours. What's quite? Marginally. Marginally. Mm. I would say quite. What is quite? Quite or quit? No, no, no. Quite. Bastante. Quite. It's like very much. Uh huh. Pretty much. Good. So, uh, Sylvia, this is quite, this is quit. Oh, okay. All right. Uh -huh. okay, okay, okay. So, and, and we have another one. Uh, quiet. Quiet. Ooh, three different words, similar, but different. We have we, uh, quiet, quit, quiet, quiet, and quiet. Uh huh. So quiet is like quiet. bastante. So my results are bastante peor, quite uh, quite worse than yours. All right. Good. Let's go continue with the with the the last one. I have a doubt in seven. Sure. Longest, okay. longest, say, longest, uh, longest, longest, the longest. Okay, let's let's first what is the quiet. let's clarify what is the doubt uh, that we have for quiet. What's the doubt? I think he is imaginary because they uh, or he is saying only are only marginally. Oh, only that's true. Bit. That's true. Thank you, Raul. This is a, this is keyword only, right? If we remove this one, we can use quiet. Right? Yeah, marginally it's it's better. We can use both. In this case, is marginally it's 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 uh better. Thank you. Thank you, Ro. Good point. Slower. Longest. The longest. The longest. The long. Mm. Yes. Are you sure? Longest. Longer. No. No, what? longer, not, not longer, it's not. Longest. Because there, there longest. is longest. The longest. 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 Longer. The longest. Are you doing a comparative? Yes, this is comparative. <laughs> All right. And what about this one? 
So this is comparative. Mm. So look at this. Look at this. The slower you work, the longer oh, yeah. Yeah. the job will take you to finish. So what do you think about this? The longest or the longer? Let's put the longest. You, do you agree the longest? Yes, longest. I think. Yeah? Longest. Yeah. Okay. Let's see the results. I will explain this one later, right now. Do you see how but many good... Not then, the, the word then. What? The word, the word then... It's not then, in, oh, the, in then. the sentence. All right. All right, let's see. Check the score. Six. We have two. We have two, two wrong. Two wrong. Which ones are can the we, wrong can, ones can here? Can we check? Can we I check? Cannot, I cannot move it. What's oh. going on? Give me a sec. Let's what? see. <laughs> Oh, okay, okay, there we go. Let me erase everything here. Oh, ho, ho. one and two. Let me begin with this one. When this is, this is, apparently, it is, apparently it is a, a superlative because you see the word the, all right? But it's like in Spanish you say, mientras más despacio, más trabajo tendrás, right? O más te llevará. So, cuando estamos, cuando tenemos aquí un comparative, even we have this one, the next one needs to be with ER too, okay? So, for example, another example, entre más rápido, mejor. The faster, the better, or the best. What do you think about this? Better, the best. Uh huh. So the we better. have the bet, the faster, the better, right? So we have a comparative. So we need to use a comparative. Okay. So if we have a superlative here, we needed a superlative here as well. All right. So in this one, it's 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 that that was the case for this one. All right. So um let's scroll down for the one here, lesser. So what happened with this one? Why uh, lesser uh, not? Uh unless. there is one one little detail. The, the, for uh, for which we cannot use lesser. Where it is not the word the. That. Excellent. Where is the word the? We don't have it anywhere. We don't have it anywhere. So what is the meaning of far? What is the meaning of far less? We have far less. In this case, guys, far no es lejos, all right? In this case, no es far. So in this case is, let's read it. We find we find that we have far less. We translate this as mucho menos tiempo. In this case, far yeah. es mucho, all right? No es lejos, okay? Any doubt? La, mi, mi, una... mm -hmm. No, no doubt. Okay, now we're going to do this one. We're going to do uh, an exercise individually, or do you, it's a it's a pretty long exercise. It's like uh, let me see. We have 20, 20, uh, 20 sentences. Let's do something. Let's do it in groups. We're gonna do it in groups. And I need, after uh, you complete this, please send me a screenshot with the results. I need only, listen, I need only one screenshot per group. If there are four groups, I only need four screenshots of the exercise, all right? So I will 
I will send the link right now. I will send the link right now to the WhatsApp. Just a second. All right. You have the link right there. So please work in groups right now. One people, one person can share the screen while the others participate to complete it, all right? Please make sure everyone uh, participates. So uh, let me create, I'm gonna create only four groups, all right? Let's go people. You only have approximately five, six minutes. This is very easy because you are going to be working in teams. Let's go. Let's go everyone to the breakout rooms. All right, let's go to the breakout rooms. Uh, I want to hear only English. English only in the breakout rooms. All right, let's go everyone to the breakout rooms. Let's go everyone. Let's go to the breakout rooms. Joseph, Sylvia, Moises, Jacqueline, Christina, Marco. Uh, let's go, let's go, Sylvia. Christina, Jancy, let's go to the breakout room. Good evening, guys. Can... Okay, can I share my screen? Okay, thank you. Thank you. Okay, the number one is Mr. Brown is experienced. The most experienced experience. tour in your anniversary. In our, sorry, in our university. Okay, and the number two. I share my screen. Uh, I was mute. Sorry. Thank you, Rafa. <laughs> okay, okay. Where is the. Okay. okay. There it is. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. Mr. Brown is expensive. More expensive. Experienced. Experienced. Superlative. The most expensive. Is the most. The most. The most. The most. The The uh, yes. the four, uh, simple, simple pasa. Uh -huh. Experience. 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 We have, we have only put this, write this. Uh, All the adjectives. That is, that is a yeah. That is a correct one. Okay, Mr. Okay, Brown okay, is the okay. most experienced tutor in our university. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you. all right. We, ha we have to write mm -hmm. all this. Okay, 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 okay. 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 Mm -hmm. uh, pupils should be paid. Uh, brilliant. 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 Brilliant composition. Uh, brilliant position. Brilliant or brilliant? Brilliant. Bri Maybe it could be brilliant. I'm not sure if that Let word exists. Check. I don't know. <laughs> okay. I think that could be uh, the most brilliant, but I don't know. A brilliant composition. I don't know. Teacher, you are here. Tell us. Mm, I'm here, but what Brilliant. do you think it's what do you think it's better? <laughs> it's right what, right now. Sounds, <laughs> what sounds better? The most it is, brilliant. It is the most brilliant. The most brilliant. Yes, the most brilliant. 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 Yeah, brilliant is I never heard that, that word yep. before. <laughs> yeah, it sounds weird. <laughs> yeah. Brilliant. Oh yes, it's three syllables. <laughs> Um, I think it's green is 
the best teacher in the in the most interesting 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 it was Chris who who wrote brilliant brilliant is short or long brilliant brilliant The most or 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 the no, the bride, bride, so I I it's difficult pronunciation. The bride. The most for me is the most the most brilliant. It's okay. No. Yes, the most brilliant composition. In the, it was Chris. I said, how do you say? I type chat. I think. In the chat, yes. you're right. Um, Can you see? The brigades for you. Yes. The verb is brilliant. Brilliant. Uh -huh. It's For me, is the most brilliant. Uh, oh. brilliant. It's okay. The most brilliant. The five? Number five? Spring is pleasant. Yes. Spring is the most recent season of the year. Joseph and Jonathan or the most. Spring is the pleasantest season of the year. Pleasant. Oh, the for me is, is too please, please. I don't know. And the six? In number six? I think the most, the most clean. The verb is short. Strong promise. One syllable. Can be, can be clean. Clean it. Clean it. Clean it. Clean it. Clean it. Of all. <clears throat> Number seven. Right. I don't know. Great, great. Double T. Double T. Uh, Double T. And in this case. Oh, eh, the spelling. No. 
Queens. British. The British. British. It's okay? No. Add B. I'm sorry, uh, I. Mm -hmm. Add I. Of all politics. The greatest one. Can you put the letter the letter I? Give me ideas. Oh. It's okay, no. I think. Number eight. I think. Uh, oh, or. Uh, is more difficult. No. Game is. The most difficult. Yeah. The most. Yeah. The most difficult. Most difficult. I mean, the, I think the most uh, are working. Working. Okay, and ten. Also, for me, for me also, I I think is uh, the the most. And you, Jonathan? James is the most open my person. Yes, the most. In this case, the chip is one of the, the oldest. The oldest. It's okay. Yes. Okay. Largest. Largest. The second. No, second. Canada is the second large. Country. In this case, not a Canada is the second more for me. Large is the short. Is short the verbs? The most. Joseph, Jonathan. Most, I think the most. The most. The most kind hearted. All right. Kind. All right. Kind. What about stupid? The most the stupid or the stu stupidest? Hmm. 
No, That's a good I, one. What do you think about it? Must, for me, it's a must. <laughs> The 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 is short. Is it short? Y yes. All right. So write it. So the stupidest. The stupidest. All right. All right. Changeable. That's very easy. Uh huh. Uh huh. Super easy. Desde el momento que vean una palabra larga, ya no puede ser ESD. Tiene que ser most. So, comfortable, the most comfortable. Good. Credible, credible. What? Excellent. The last, the last, Excellent. The, the most credible. Good. Popular. Uh -huh. what, what do you think about popular? popular. The most Oh, excellent. Very good. Very good. <laughs> Ugly. Ooh, that's short. That is short. So what is that? Excellent, Veronica. The ugliest and bad. This is irregular. This is irregular. So be careful with this one. Awesome. Click on check. Ooh, what's up? What what happened? Ooh, let's see. Let's let's go back. Uh click on okay. Click on okay. Okay, let's go back. The pleasant. Oh the, the most, most the pleasant. Most. Yeah. Oh. oh greatest. Está mal de letra. Solo por eso. No porque está bien. Ay, aquí me equivoqué. Yeah. Uh -huh, okay. but it's, not it's okay. okay. Let's see the, the 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 next one. The largest. Huh? The lar hey, what happened with that one? It's okay the, for me. The second. No. Oh. In the case, no. no. Está bien, está bien, Veronica. Pero como el de ya lo llevaba anterior, ¿ves? decía de largest. Uh -huh. Solo por, hay que quitarle el D, pero está, it's good. Now, the mm. stupid, ¿por qué no salió mal stupid? The, oh, let's see, what's, um, it for the, no. No, that's good, I don't know why. It's changeable, falta una N en changeable. Aquí. Okay. Mm -hmm. O sea, que es más, don't worry, it's okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Yo te cream, no. yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. Let's go back to the main session, okay? Let's okay. go back. All right. All ready. All ready. Let's see. Let's see. All right, so I saw a couple of the uh, screenshots in the group that uh, those were good. So let's see. Um, <clears throat> we have three images here, or right, uh, two, two images here. Let's see. In the group of uh, Sylvia, Rebecca, uh, Fernando, which is the incorrect one? Uh, um, yeah, because in one, um, Rebecca didn't have the camera on. I know, but no, but in the sentences. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, <laughs> I think you are uh, asking for the pictures. Oh, uh, no, no, no. <laughs> it's okay. <it's, laughs> uh, I don't remember Fernando or Raul. No, uh, Carlos, help me. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. I, I can find maybe it was the 20 the 20th because I don't see uh, the error. Let me see the chair. Uh, the 12th. The number 12. Was, because I think we, it was the, the, the 20th. Put the largest. Because because the number 12. So, no, but that, that's good. I can find the error. Maybe there is one, but I don't know which one. Maybe the 20th, because I cannot see here. Let's see. Let's go with the next one. 
this is for Carlos, uh, the same. So you send the same? So how many Oh, yes. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Juan, Juan Rebecca is. How many, how many pictures did you send? All right, too. <laughs> okay, it's okay. What about the others? What about the others? I was expecting that. All right. So I think you got the idea of the superlatives, right? So let's do this one together. Now, in this one, we need to find, this is an advanced exercise. We need to make the correction. Let's see. Number one, number one is correct or incorrect. Read. No me digan al azar. Read the sentence. It's correct or incorrect. What do you think about this one? Number one. You think it's wrong? It's wrong? It's wrong, teacher. It's wrong. Are you sure? I don't know. I'm gonna put the yes, I'm gonna put wrong. the answers. Wrong. Wrong? Okay. All right. Let's see. I'm not sure. I'm gonna I'm gonna do what you tell me to do. Number two. It's correct. Okay. It's correct. 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 All right. What about number three? Incorrect. Incorrect. Wrong. 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 Okay. Wrong. Let's see. Number four. Run. Wrong. Wrong. Correct. Oh, correct. Correct or wrong? Is correct. Correct. I think it's correct. Let's put correct right now. Let's see. We're going to check them later. All right. So number five. Let's see. We have to eight. I have number a doubt. I have five. a doubt, teacher. With, yes. Uh, with the with the number four. Five. Protest or prot? Protest. Protest. Uh, it, yeah. It's oh, one. Yeah. It's, it, there is not uh, a superlative. It's only a. Uh, oh, protest. Word. This is a verb. Okay. Mm -hmm. But not in superlative. No, no, no. Prot because superlatives okay. Okay. are okay. only for adjectives. Okay, okay. The more mm -hmm. broad. The, the example teacher is um, like like we we saw at the beginning. Yes, yes, that's correct. So yeah, we're gonna so they say it's correct. Maybe we're gonna check them later, right? Uh what about number five? Uh, what do you think about it? Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's correct. That's correct. Sounds good. All right. Yeah. All right. What do you think? I people think do? It's, it's correct. correct. It's correct. correct. Okay. It's incorrect. It's incorrect. I think it's incorrect. All right. Okay. Let's just try to remember what you said about number the four and number and number five, so we can check them later. Uh, number five. Let's go to it's number. Correct. Six. Correct. It's correct. It's correct. Number All right. six is wrong. Let's see. Number six. Wrong. It's correct. It's correct. Correct. Yes. Incorrect. Yes. It's correct. 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 Wrong. Correct. Hmm. Incorrect. Incorrect. Incorrect, teacher, because your dog is more friendly than me. Wow. It's so late. Than mine. One, two. Oh yeah, I'm my wrong. It's know. wrong. It's wrong. Wrong. All right. Yeah, it's wrong. What about yeah. number seven? Richest than one. I think this is correct. It's wrong. It's wrong. wrong. It's considerable. It's wrong. Richest. Considerable richest. 
The riches is superlative. Mm -hmm. Oh, I I know what. Yeah, it's wrong. It's wrong, but, right? But it's wrong. It's wrong. A comparative. Yeah. It's wrong. Oh, okay. Good point. Yeah. All right. Okay. So, final, final um uh, answer number seven. Correct or wrong? <laughs> wrong. 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 Okay. Okay. Wrong. And the Who last. Wants to be millionaire. <laughs> All right. <laughs> <laughs> it is correct. It's correct. It's correct. The seven for me is correct. What is them? What is them? <laughs> them. I think them. <laughs> then or oh, them? No. What is no. them? Them <laughs> is like um. Cinco de noviembre. Them. You got it. Nope. Presa. Nope. Excellent. Yeah. A dam. 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 Oh. Dam. Okay. Una cosa es dam. Y otra es dam. Like, dam. oh, maldición, right? What is, the, what is the definition of dam? Dam es presa. De esas presas hidroeléctricas. Ah, uh, dam. All right. Okay. All right. So that's, uh, oh, the results. I'm sorry. Let's see. Ooh, okay. Let's see. Let's see. Where is the results right now? Zero. Mm, not. <laughs> Let's see. The results <laughs> are the result is four. Ta, 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 ta. Four out of five. So that's <gasps> five. So let's see. Number one is uh incorrect. Let's see. Number one, let's go one by one. Number one, it's incorrect. Uh huh. And you said it was it was wrong, but it's correct. All right. Mm -hmm. Number two, you said it was correct, and it was that's number two, wrong. Okay. Mm hmm. Fewer, fewer. Do you remember that? I think that is a that's part of basic, basic four, basic five, something like this. Fewer, less. Por qué no puedo ocupar less, guys? Y por qué tengo que ocupar uh, fewer? Any it's idea? Because you are is a is a comparative. Mm -hmm. uh, we are using a dam. Not we are... really. Not really. Depende de esta, de esta palabra. People. People. Uh, Todos aquí. Because it's a contable. It's a um, uh -huh, uh -huh. Contable. contable. It's and a contable, countable it's noun. Thing. Thank you, Mireli, mm -hmm. and thank you, Raul. Very good. It's a good countable evening. noun. Good evening. Good evening, evening, for evening. <laughs> All right. So with countables, we cannot use less. We use few. All right. Few people. All right. Mm. Good. That's okay. a good memory. That's a good memory. Good. Let's let's see. Number three. Number three was incorrect. The, the, uh, it was wrong. And the actual car. The actual answer is correct. Tennis is a far harder game than football. All right? All right, it's correct. Okay? I forgot to mention something very important. This exercise, it was for both comparatives and superlatives. Sorry about that. Pequeño detalle. Yeah, I'm sorry, but it's good. All right? So let's go to number four. So number four is the, oh, this is what we're talking about. The more you protest, what is the correct one? The guiltier. The more you protest, the guiltier you look. All right? So yeah. if, if we're using comparatives in the first one, you need to use comparatives in the second part of the sentence. All right? Very good. 
guys, do you have any doubt about the superlatives? We are not going to see the superlatives anymore. We need to move on to another topic, which is a little bit more complex. No? All right. So we're going to move to the next uh, exercise right now. I need all of your attention, please. If you have any questions, let me know. Let's see. What well, question number one, Veronica? Can you please help us with question number one? Who are employees monitored at your company? Okay. Next, Veronica. What kind of document documentation is documentation? Documentation is used in your company to make sure employees are doing a good job. All right. Question guys. I want to I want to hear you right now. So num the question number one is this. How are employees monitored in your company? Imagine your imagine uh, the boss, the quality department, the managers of your company. How do they monitor employees? Based on your jobs, how do they monitor employees? In, in my case, with my uh, team and my boy, boss, we uh, we have uh, every every month every Monday we have a uh, a little uh, review about the the uh, about the schedule uh, about the 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 goals in the uh, after a week and we try to 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 put uh, new goals. Uh, uh, for the for the week, okay, and and in and then and maybe maybe Wednesday or Thursday we my boss uh, um, uh, had uh, a, a review with me because okay. she 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 needs uh, to review my activities. Okay, excellent. That's a that's a pretty clear idea. Now, the only thing that I would change, Freddie, in order to put new new goals, I would say to set, set new goals for the week, right? New set goals, new goal. okay. New, Thank set you. new goals, all right, okay. excellent. Very good. Any other? How uh, we, do you, uh-huh. Okay, okay, okay. Uh, we have a, a document in, in, in um, of the schedule of activities uh, for each oh. person. For each person, uh, when 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 uh, anybody um, um, do the 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 activities, uh, when the people have. Mm -hmm. Okay, so by doing a checklist or a schedule of the activities, that's a way to monitor things. Very good. So we have many different ways to monitor employees. Mary. Hi, uh, good good evening. Good evening. Uh, in my in my job, mm -hmm. uh, we have a annual work plan, and the all the months is necessary to to report the advance in the in the goals, mm -hmm. and all the all the the main director of our area. Mm -hmm. uh, he evaluate uh, the three, the, the one subdirect, subdirector and two uh, manage, manage, manager, uh, and then they evaluate the, the team of the, of the boss. Uh, in my case, I need to evaluate uh, the personnel that work with me, and we, we evaluate different areas. For example, the the goods if, uh, for the month for the month the assistencia the attendance attendance the attendance and the efficient in the use of the resource we evaluate this area and report 
uh, per month the advantage of the goods. Okay, excellent. That's a lot of work, right? Yes, is is very interesting because I am work I am working in a public institution, and we have a lot of controls uh, for the the public money, and mm. we need to 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 do a lot of work to to show that we are using the the, the resource in good way. All right. For that reason, we have a lot of controls. The uh, internal internal control and the external control uh, for a private enterprise, but we have a, a control for the government, the central mm -hmm. government. For that reason, we need to to do a lot of work to try to 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 show that we are using in a good way the resource of the of the government for the public people. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, sounds sounds like a lot of a lot of work to do. All right, excellent. So let's continue. Thank you the ones for sharing. That's good participation. I'm taking that into account. All right, so let's continue with this one. Um, conversation. This is kitchen manager, Mary and kitchen manager again. Guys, please. I need your attention in this structure. This is for the uh, should and past participle, all right? Should and past participle. So please pay attention to this structure, to this structure and to this structure. Let's see. Kitchen manager, you are going to be Joseph. Mary, you are going to be, let's see, Jacqueline Carpio. You are the uh you are Mary, right? Let's go. Let's go with this conversation. Uh, okay. I am Marison. Yeah, you're Mary. Uh mm -hmm. Joseph? All right. Where's Mario? He is late for his ship. Mario? Goodness. I got a call, a call that he is very sick. I should have told, told you earlier. Don't worry. He should have called my direct, my directory. How do you say directly? Directly. 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 Uh -huh. If he had called to me to me to my phone, I could have phoned a substitute by now. I have time this afternoon. Let me cover for him. Okay. Let me cover for him. Good. Let's check another another pair. Let's go with the kitchen manager. You are going to be Jonathan and Mary. You are going to be Veronica. Let's Teacher, go. Sorry. Uh, the pronunciation is called or called. Oh, good. The pronunciation for this one is like this. Cold. Cold. Ah. Mm -hmm. Se pronuncia. Justamente como se escribe frío. Así, cold. ¿Y cómo se pronuncia cold? Así igual. Ok. <laughs> so, cold. All right. Ok. Let's see. Uh, kitchen manager, Jonathan, and uh, Veronica, Mary. Let's go. Ok. Where's Mario? He's late for his ship. Mario, goodness, I got a call the, that he is very sick. I I should have told you early. Don't worry, he should have called call me directly. If he have called to my phone, I could have found a sub substitute by now. I have died this afternoon. Let me cover for him. Let me cover for him. Very good. 
let me give you a tip for the pronunciation of these words. This one. Let's begin with should have. So the pronunciation for this one, should have, please pronounce it as should, like should have, should have. I should have told you earlier, like this. I should have, I should have told you earlier, okay? In this case, it's the same. Could, could have, could oof. Okay, I could have found a substitute. I should have called, I could have found, I should have told. All right, let's practice that pronunciation. Let's go one more time. Kitchen manager, you are going to be Carlos Alvarado. And Mary, you are going to be Xiomara. Xiomara, are you here? No, Xiomara, you're not here. I, I have. Yes, I'm have here, a... teacher. All right. Uh, Sorry. I have a doubt. I have a doubt. Yes. Sir, I, uh, I am um, this. What is the, the tense of this uh, structure? Or, or the should have is a uh, past. Is past. Uh, participle. Yeah. This oh. is this is past participle. Ah, okay. Okay. Uh -huh. So in the meeting, in the meeting is literally in Spanish is debería de decir. Debería haber. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Debería haberle dicho. Oh. Debería haberle llamado. Podría oh. haber encontrado. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Excellent. Very Thank good. Ya vamos a llegar a eso. Don't worry. So let's see. Uh, oh, I forgot. Kitchen manager. Oh, Carlos yeah. and uh, Xiomara Mary. Let's go. Okay. Where's Mario? He's late for his shift. Mario? Goodness. I got a call that he's very sick. I should have told you earlier. Don't worry. He should have called me. Perfect. Literally. I have called to my phone and could have phoned a substitute by now. I have time this afternoon. Let me cover for him. Thank you very much. Good pronunciation. That is a pronunciation that I want to hear from everyone else. Should have, could have. Okay, we have another would have. Would have, like would have, would have. Okay, should have, could have, uh, would have. All right. So we're gonna check on this pronunciation later, all right? So let's see here, let's go with this one. How to use the perfect models. So Freddie, you were asking for this one, Freddie. What is the tense for this one? This is the perfect models, all right? Oh, okay. This is the tense Thank for you. this one, all right? So let's see, we're gonna read this one. Please pay attention to the reading. So if you can, um, if you have doubts or questions, raise your hand and ask. All right. So let's see. Can Raul help us read the use, please, of this uh, models? Okay. Use perfect models to express regret or remove about past actions. All right. Two things that are important. Number one, this is regret. only for regret or remorse. In what tense? What tense, guys? Past actions. Past, past actions. Past. This past is actions. not excellent. This is not for the present. This is not for the future. This is a past. It's a regret. What, what is a regret? Arrepentimiento. Huh? Arrepentimiento. When you did someone, so, something, something that is wrong. And that you is wrong. To... Or, or when you didn't something that you needed to do. Right? That could be also a regret. So basically, a regret is like, uh, I podría haber hecho algo. Something that I could have done and I didn't do it, right? 
when that I is did, when I did the wrong things. Yes and no. Like uh when you did something bad that you could have done better, or when you didn't do anything for something that you could have done for both. So it's like lamentarse, ya sea por algo que hice o por algo que no hice. Por ejemplo, <coughs> déjeme poner esa, este, este, esta idea en español para que entendamos más fácilmente. Salí de la casa, no llevé sombrilla, llovió. Y digo, podría haber llevado sombrilla. Ahí entonces uso, I could have brought my umbrella. I should have brought my umbrella. I would have brought my umbrella. Right? Podría haber, debería haber, hubiera traído. So those are the three translations. Esas son traducciones literales al, al español. Could have, podría haber. Would have, habría. Should have, debería haber. Three things. All right? Now, let's check some examples. Peter, can you repeat, please? Uh, could have, podría. Podría haber. Podría haber. Podría haber. Y de ahí, pues, le ponemos el, el past participle. Podría haber, I don't know, comido en casa. Podría haber traído dinero. Podría, any, any context. Would have, right? habría. Uh, uh, what, which one? I, I need, to, please teacher, can you repeat the meaning of could have, should have? Oh, yeah. Could have, and... podría haber. Should have, debería haber. Y would have, would have, hubiera hecho tal cosa. All right? That's the, that's the literal translation for that in Spanish. Now, let's take a look at this one. Let's see. Look at the example. Look at the look at the uh, structure, and then look at the example right here. Let's see, Joseph. Please read the structure. Please read the structure for should have. Use should have plus past participle to tell to talk about to talk. Talk. To talk, to talk about regret. Regrets. Joseph, repeat with me. Look at this. Look at the look at the, the screen. Talk. Talk. Uh, mm -hmm. talk. That's the pronunciation for this one. To, to talk. talk. To talk about. Excellent. Regrets. Regrets. Good. Good. All right. Now let's see some examples about regrets. All right. Number one, Sylvia, what is example number one? I should have sent the report sooner. Sooner. Mm -hmm. Report. 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 El acento va en port. Report. All right? So, report. Uh, me lamento. El jefe me regañó y digo, uh, I should have sent the report sooner. Debería haber enviado. I should have end the report sooner. All right. Let's see. Example number two. Let's go with example number two. And uh, please help us. Uh, let's see. Nubia. Yeah. I sure, I sure ask her to carry those boxes. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. So thank you, Nubia. So we can use them in negative two. I shouldn't have. I shouldn't have asked her to carry those boxes. ¿Qué quiere decir? Que a lo mejor lo botó. Y va algo fragile. Y, le, y se, ahora lamentamos y decimos, no debería haberle pedido que me ayudara. I shouldn't have asked her to carry those boxes. So that's a regret. Una lamentación. All right, so we use this one for regrets. Okay. Teacher, in yes. negative, we we don't use uh, the contraction, but we can we can use the, the 
the contraction. You can for use example. it. Uh -huh. For example, go ahead. For example, in positive, uh, I should send the report, but in negative, uh, can you repeat uh, when you use the contraction? Oh, the pronunciation? Yeah, the, the pronunciation. Shouldn't. I shouldn't sure. have. I shouldn't have. Mm -hmm. Okay. I shouldn't have okay. asked her. ¿Cómo decimos, guys? No le hubiera llamado. How do you say that? Shouldn't. I, I shouldn't. I shouldn't, I shouldn't have, have called. Called. I mm -hmm. shouldn't have called. Excellent. I shouldn't have called, shouldn't have called Fernando. Shouldn't have called. I shouldn't have called Joanna Mireli. Right? Ahora, el problema está en que no nos sepamos el pasado participio de verbo, porque ahí está todo. All right. So, aquí el fundamento es el past participle of the verbs. El should have es el inicio. Hmm. How do you say hubiera ido a la fiesta? A ver, who can tell me that? Hubiera ido a la fiesta. I should have gone to the party. Excellent, Ro. Very good. I should have gone to the party. All right. I, I wouldn't. I, I should have. I, I, I would. I should have. I should have. I should have gone to the I party. Will. I would have. No. Oh, should. I would. Debería haber. Mm. I should have. I should have gone to the party. Would have is hubiera. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I can say I will have for this sentence, teacher. Uh, yes, you can say you have the three options, Joanna. You can say I would have gone to the party, I could have gone to the party, or like Raul said, I should have gone to the party. Right, so you have three options. The meaning changes a little bit, but it's basically the same thing, right? Okay, so let's see. Teacher, in this uh, case, uh, to, to, to take a decision to use could, should, or would, it depends, uh, for example, for the suggestion, teacher, it's the same. It's the same. Ahí depende del significado que tú le quieras dar. Solo, pero en raíz es lo mismo. Sure. Debería haber, o oh, debería haber, o oh, podría haber, o oh, hubiera. Pero, it, in, in essence, it's the same thing, John. You can use the one you want. Right? I, I, I ask this question because um, in, a, in, a, in a test, for example, if it's necessary to, to change, one alternative uh, oh. mm -hmm. between three, three possibilities. Mm -hmm. it's, it's necessary to, to know uh, a clue. <laughs> oh, all right. No, but in this one, it doesn't make a difference. Okay, that's right. Yeah. All right, very good, very good. Okay, now let's say you go to a party. Let me, this is the scenario, all right? You go to a party and they don't give you enough Food. And you say, hubiera comido en la casa. How do you say that? I have eaten in house. I should I have, have eaten in house. I should have eaten in my 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 house. Excellent. You are you are on the road. You are traveling from San Salvador to San Miguel. And the car breaks down. And you see the 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 the, the thing in the, the like the monitor here and there is no gas. How do you say that? I I, I will have Fooling the, the car. Mm, okay, okay. Fooling. I would have gone to the Good. gas station. Okay, 
That's a variation. Thank you, Rebecca. I should have gone to the gas station. Okay, that's a variation. But how do you say llenar el tanque? Fuel. 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 What? I will have. The I will have filled the tank. The tank. Fuel. Fill the tank up. I should have filled. So what I is the what is the past participle fill for up. fill? Filling up. Filling up. Filling. Mm -hmm. uh, fill. Like this. No. What is the past participle participle for fill? Hmm. Okay. Fill. 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 This is excellent, Rebecca. This is a regular help. verb. This is a regular verb. So we only need ED. I should have filled the tank. All right? Now, one more thing. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, you are in the, in the English exam and you don't know the answers. What do you say? I should have. I should have studied. Have to study. Uh -huh, all right. Yesterday. I should have studied. Uh -huh. I'm good at studying. I, I should I should have have pay, will be the first. Pay attention in classes. Uh huh. Excellent. I should. Excellent, Mireli. That's another variation. I should have paid attention in classes here. All right. I should, I I should, should have, have asked you for a copy. <laughs> oh, Rafael. Rafael, <laughs> Rafael Carranza, repeat. <laughs> <laughs> I should have asked for a copy. <laughs> <laughs> is, All right. the moment, is the moment for a truth. ¿Cómo se dice? It's the better way, the better way. Así se van conociendo las cosas. How do you say that? How, how how can we say así se van conociendo las cosas? To start with, eso es bien salvadoreño, right? So maybe uh, we cannot use the same translation in English. That maybe we have another another translation for that. But it's the moment say, for the truth. For the truth. It's the moment for the truth or for yeah. why? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There is no like a literal translation for that. Mm -hmm. All right. Very it's a good. Price of our, uh, Salvadorian principle. It's a, yeah, that's correct. It's a Salvadorian idiomatic expression. All right. Now, let's see. Let's go. Help me. I need your help. Let's see here. Number one. I'm going to, I'm going to tell the name. I'm going to call out your name. Number one is for Xiomara. Only Xiomara. Let's go, Xiomara. Okay. I should have bought more water. How do you spell bought? B O U H mm -hmm. No G sorry mm -hmm. H T All right read the sentence one more time I should have bought more water Okay repeat with me I should have I should have should have okay I should have bought should what t-shirt? Sorry, can uh -huh. you repeat? I, yeah, I should okay. have bought. Should have. I should have bought more water. All right, good. Jose, number two. You should have listened to me. How do you spell listen? What's the what is the past participle for listen? Um, with ed. All right. Listen. Good job. Let's continue with Fernando. This is negative. Okay. Uh, I should have. I shouldn't have forgotten my passport. Forgotten? No, no, no. Forgot. Forgot. Forgot it. It's okay. Okay, forgotten. which is the right one? Forgot or forgotten? Forgotten. Forgotten. All right. Good. Yeah. Oh, let's see this one. Raul. Yeah. 
he should have wore a tie to the restaurant. How do you spell worn? W O A R A R A R No no to uh, uh, I uh, I have a mistake All right it's W O R E oh, What was the last letter E E, e? Mm. War, war is the simple past. And I need the present, I mean, I'm sorry, I need the past participle. So what is the past participle? Just change the last letter for another. One. Excellent. Okay. Now, please read it one more time with the correct pronunciation for this one. He should have worn a tie to the restaurant. All right. Now, should have. Let's go one more time. Should have. Should have. Mm -hmm. He should have worn. <clears throat> Ready? He one more time. should have worn mm -hmm. a tie to the restaurant. Excellent. Good job, Raul. Very good. Freddy. Oh, this one is easy, Freddy, for you. <laughs> no, no, it's, not, it's not easy. It's difficult. <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay. Uh, the past participle of it, uh, it is eating. Eating? I don't know. How, how do you eating? how do you say? No, uh, eat, eating, eating. Oh, like this. But um, wait, wait, wait. I don't see. Yeah, yeah. Excellent. Okay. Now, can you please read how, this? How, 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 how is the correct pronunciation? Sorry. Eaten. Eaten. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay. I should not have eaten so much excellent now what you have to do i i have not eaten so much now um i have to go to the doctor no oh i oh i have to take a pill uh, i okay, shouldn't okay. have eaten so much yeah right i have to take a the salon. conclusion the conclusion uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. correct okay. thank you all okay. right very good. All right, let's continue here with the next one. And the other is for Mireli. Mireli? Not here? Yes, 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 I'm, I'm All right. here. <laughs> yes. All right, we, number we, six. We shouldn't have driven during the storm. Driving? What is the pronunciation for this one, Mireli? Driven. Driven. Uh huh. So simple present, drive. Drive. Simple past, drove. Drove. Simple, I mean, past participle, driven. Driven. Uh huh. Excellent. Very good. Very good. Now, let's see. Number seven. This is for Rebecca. Mm, it's hiding. You should not have hidden your sister phone. Stand. All right. Now, hiden. Is that the correct one? It's the pronunciation for this one, Rebecca, is like it's similar to this one. So what is the pronunciation for this one? Um driven. Hidden. Hidden. Excellent. Good job. Awesome. Okay, three more. Let's go with um, Jancy. Number eight, Jancy. Mm. 
Jancy, a la una. Sorry, yeah. teacher. <laughs> All, right. Okay. All right. Let's go. I should have. I should what? have. Mm -hmm. um... All right. Mm -hmm. do... What is the past participle for do? Um, participle for do, do, do. Ah, I don't remember, teacher. All right. um, <clears throat> let's see, let's ask for help. Can anybody tell me what is the past participle for do? Done. 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 Yes. Done. Okay, Jancy. Now, can you please read it one, one more time okay. all together? I shall have done more research. More research. 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 Thank all right. Good. Let's continue with Alejandra. Alejandra, number nine. No, Alejandra. All right. Let's continue then with, um, let's see, who has not participated? Joseph. Me, teacher. All right. She should, she should not have drunk so much how wine. Do you, how do you spell drunk? Drunk. How drunk. do you spell that? Uh -huh. uh, how drunk. do you spell? Oh, sorry. Uh, spell it uh, for me. She, she yeah. should not have drunk so much wine. Okay. And... How do you spell? How do you spell the word? Ah, uh, D. E. The R. Mm hmm. U. Mm hmm. K. No. K. No. 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 Wrong. Sorry. Sorry. Uh, mm -hmm. N. 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 Okay. 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 Can you please read the sentence one more time? Me. Yes. She should not have drunk so much wine. Excellent. Now, that means that she is pissed. She's borracha, right? Right now. She shouldn't have drunk so much wine. Now she's tipsy. All right, tipsy. Well, not tipsy, drunk. All right, so number 10. Let's go with Sylvia. I I should I should have written more. I should have written more. Excellent. <clears throat> so <clears throat> I'm sorry. So what I think it's important right now is to know the past participles. That's 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 the thing. All right. If you know the past participles, everything will be good. All right. Everything will be good. OK, so let's see. Um, let me erase this one right here. So I have uh, another exercise for you. OK. We're gonna do it in groups right now. This is for you to practice, but please practice because I had entered some rooms in which people is not speaking. Eh, y ahí está la gente diciendo, por ejemplo, I, I don't know, cualquier nombre. Sofía, are you there? Sofía, Sofía, and Sofía is not participating. All right, please, if you if you are in a group, no le dejen el trabajo solo a una a una persona. He visto que le han dejado el trabajo solo a una persona. I know. All right, so please participate. This is this is your time. So let me uh, send this one right here. Uh, we are going to use, remember that you have three options. You can use should have, you can use could have, or you can use would have. Right now, maybe we are only using should have, it's okay, right? Uh, so remember that according to the context, it could be positive, affirmative, or negative. No siempre va a ser should have. Puede ser shouldn't have, depending on the context. All right? So let me send you right now, right now, the, 
Just a second. All right. Oh, se fue dos veces. I'm sorry. It's only one. Only one. All right. So, please open this one. Si no quieren escribir, no escriban. Solo hablen. All right. Díganse las respuestas. Oral speaking. Oral activity. All right. You don't have to write anything. But please speak right now. Let's go. <clears throat> Let me create the groups right now. Just give me one second. I'm going to recreate them because uh, the other... In the other groups, there were people that were not here. So three, three groups right now. Let's go, people. Let's go, guys, to the groups. I'll be checking who is participating. I'll be joining his each group right now. Let's go, let's go. Let's go, Christina. Let's go, Jacqueline, Jancy, Alejandra. Let's go to the main session. I mean, not to, to the breakout rooms. Um, I don't, I don't know if you wanna. Um. Can can you share for them? Share share the, the screen. Yeah, just give me a second. I'm gonna download yeah. the image. Oh, you you are always the only the the, the choose one. <laughs> <laughs> in every okay. in every group. Okay. What, what I have have you, you are the always the, the thing. Okay. Can you... Okay. Just... How do you okay. say? Tú eres el elegido. How do you say that? The verb is correct. The tense is incorrect. Choose is correct. How do you say elegido? We said chosen. The chosen one. Chosen. And say chosen. Fernando is the chosen one. Chosen one. Okay. All right. Very important. The chosen one. All right. Let's continue. You can say you are only you are the one. You are the yeah. You can say you are the one too. You are um. the one to share. All right. All right. Thank you. Okay. Um, okay. I'm okay. gonna open a new word document. What? Okay. Uh, copy and paste here. And just let me change this. I'm gonna blow up this. Okay. Thank you. Okay, thanks, Fernando. Sir, um, yeah. here. The flowers die. The flowers die. I I should I should have should should have what is should have I should have what what are what it's like regar is a regular no. verb no I don't know I should about it dry this word from agua is that but yeah, regar but no what no is is a verb is a verb yes it's a verb. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah. what in this is occasion is is working like a bird, like the okay. action of okay. I don't know how to say um water to add water to the plants. Okay. <laughs> yeah, putting putting but, but, water but, to the but, that's but just give 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 me a look that that bird. But what is the past participle of what? Regar, as it is. Uh -huh, it's regar. Water, water is a, a verbo de regar. Entonces, yeah. Si es, muy bien. Okay. Sí. Es que sí, es que sí le recuerdo, participle. es que sí le recuerdo del, de, del P5, porque sí recuerdo que vimos algo parecido. Entonces, por eso es que, sí. 
Eh, ahora, ¿cuál es el pasado mm. participio de esto? No sé. Uh, the Spanish. Let me see. I, I am, I am, I am no sure. Oh, I am We researching. only have AD. Mm. AD? I don't know. AD. What it is. What it is. What it is. Maybe it's what it is. What it is. Yeah. AD. Yeah, what it is. Yes. Yeah. Having yeah. water. Water. Mm -hmm. I should have watered. I should have watered them more often. Yeah, that's good. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Next one. I'm so sorry for this. Okay. And then I, the number five. I, I, I should have. I should have been. I should I have. Been, I should I have been. been. Should, yes, I should, should have. Should have, have been. Being more careful. Should have been more careful. Number six. Just. Angry. In this case, he's John Cool. Cool. And the number six it could be John's father's got angry. John shouldn't have told him a lie. Shouldn't, shouldn't, uh -huh, shouldn't have told yes. him a lie. Okay. That's the option. Good job. Number seven, the I am broke. Uh -huh. To send the image. Uh, yes. Before the send, ah, no, 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 no. Um, like, like a picture. Uh -huh. No, 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 no. The gallery. Ah. Open, open ah, with, I, I, with I, I, exact, exactly the text, the letter T. Ah, okay. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. But, okay. <laughs> I am not, I am my I don't watch I don't look. No. I can. <laughs> Sorry. I can. No can't. Okay. No, I can. Let we me can, we can write the, the answers, don't worry. Okay. Or in the chat of the of the when the teacher send I I try to open from the for, for, maybe, for, for maybe your for, gallery no maybe it may be for the powerpoint maybe I try. Can you watch the? Yes. Okay, I try. Sorry. <sighs> okay. Oh my God. That's silly. Okay. I need a chat GPT to, to try to help me in this moment. <laughs> okay, water. 
shoe. You can put the, the shoe, the flowers that I sure have. Water. Yes. Okay. The more of them. Okay, that's great. Right. The number four. The number four say, I'm really hungry. I should have I'm eaten. Should have ate. Eaten. 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 Okay, number number five. Maybe maybe Joseph. Joseph, can you can you can you try to structure the the sentence, please? I fell into the water. I be careful. I I I I should have I should have, have been been have been more careful. Okay. Good. The number six. John's father got angry. John. John. Tell. Will. Will we'll have. I think. I am nine. King are nine. Will. Have. Have so. Okay, token. So, T O L D. Token. In a line. Mm, past participle. Okay. Token. It's it it's it's okay. This this sentence. Um, are you sure this one let's 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 talk about that one what is the past participle for tell told, I told, remember told this told. Irregular told. Verb. yeah it's told 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 t-o-l-d told excellent that is the one that is the one okay the next one this hotel is terrible. I stay. Now, um, let's no. stop for a moment. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to interrupt no. you. Sorry okay. to interrupt you. Let's see, number six. Look at the context. John's father got angry. Okay? So, John's father right now is angry. John would have talked. Bueno, aquí es para empezar es told. This one. Would have told him a lie? Mm. Mm. I, 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 I wouldn't say that. Should have told. Should, mm, close. Shouldn't That's have. Not. Shouldn't have told him a lie. Okay. No le hubiera dicho una mentira. El es enojado. No le hubiera dicho. Shouldn't have told him a lie. Eh, that is the correct. So not all of them are, are, are affirmative. There are some that are negatives, all right? So, um... Due to the time, I'm, we're not going to be able to finish. You can do this as an extra practice, okay? At home, uh, um, later, yeah, during the weekend, okay? We need, to, we need to send you, teacher. No, no, this is just practice. I mean, you if you want to practice more, you can practice uh, later, but this is just practice. You don't have to send me anything, all right? Okay, uh, girls and boys, let's go back to the main room, okay? Okay. Uh All right, all right, very good. So guys, this is just like extra practice. We are gonna take a look at some of them maybe on Monday because remember that not all of them are affirmative. There are that there are some uh there are some negatives like uh shouldn't, right? We're gonna see that on Monday. So for now, everything is done. We can call it a day. 
Enjoy the weekend, guys. We're going to continue with this topic on Monday. And we have another one that is the third conditional for Monday, too. All right. So thank you guys for the effort. As I always say, enjoy the weekend, recharge the batteries, and see you guys on Monday at eight o'clock. All right. Thank Take you guys care, for being here. Take care, Take care. Take care. Good night, everyone. Good night. Have a nice night. See you on Monday. See you. Bye bye.